So the main thing for me tonight with our decision not to play the game was just the feeling of, of support that we have for the black community. I think with all of the things that we have shown with Black Lives Matter, you know, kneeling on the field before games, um, we would be hypocrites if we didn't stand along our, our other uh, sporting brothers tonight uh, in playing. I think when we play, we put our heart and soul into our game. And I know our fans watch us with their heart and soul also. And I just don't think it would have been genuine for us to play tonight uh, you know, with other things on our mind and not putting our heart and soul into this. Uh, after seeing another unarmed black man uh, gunned down by police and, and the, the aftermath of that, of what's going on in Wisconsin right now, you know, that was on the forefront of our minds. And enough is enough. I think we've, we've seen way too many uh, black men shot by police officers and they need to be held accountable. I think um, there's a lot of changes that need to happen in our country and, and we're at a pivotal moment right now. And this is a big moment for all of us, uh, not only as athletes, but a as people and as citizens. And and for sure, someone will respond to this video or this and say, stick to sports. And, and uh, I want to stick to sports. You think I want to be here talking about another black man that's been shot by police? Do you think I want to be speaking on this? No, I, I want to play soccer and I want to be a soccer player. And that's what I want to focus on. I don't want to be thinking about another black man shot by police again and, and having us to protest again with nothing changing. No, nothing is changing. And, and, you know, so, so to those that are telling me to stick to sports, uh, the, the message doesn't work. I'm sorry. I, I want to stick to sports. I want to play my game. I want to play the games for the fans. I want the fans to be able to, to have that release and watch us play. But right now, um, it's not on the, the front part of our minds. So I hope the fans out there understand why we didn't play tonight. And uh, we keep the conversation going. We keep the discussion going. And, and we continue to push for change in our country because I think it's badly needed.